One of the city's youngest and emerging leaders is not a business executive or a civil leader. He is a Jesuit priest. As Patricia McGeever reports, his efforts to revive his parish are helping to bring people downtown. Father Eric Knapp has been pastor at St. Xavier Church for just about four years. He was sent here by his superiors in Chicago to help revive this parish. At the same time, some new lay leaders were hired, and with everything combined, St. X is now incredibly healthy and growing. They're coming from 126 zip codes. Uh, we've had almost nearly three, 600 new households register as saying, this is where I will lay my roots or where I want to be spiritually fed. Before he was tending to this flock, Father Eric was one of four brothers growing up on a farm in Michigan, where, ironically, it was his job to tend to the sheep. He earned college degrees in English and secondary education and taught high school for a year before heading to graduate school in Chicago. That's where he met the Jesuits. He finished his degree, then entered the seminary. In another bit of irony, or prophecy, he was ordained here at St. Xavier because of a scheduling conflict in Chicago. Since he's returned as pastor, Father Eric has used what he's learned as a priest in Chicago and applied it to St. X. There was two young people in the parish who uh, came to me and said, wouldn't it be great to have a parish festival? And I said, interesting you should say that. What if we put a spin on the typical parish festival and do a block party where people would come in one night, eventually get to a week, but it just brings people downtown. And that's been our part of my mantra and my, what I feel is a responsibility as an institution in the city is that we've been here since 1819. We love downtown. We want people to come downtown. We want people to be exposed to downtown. And that means we have to be good neighbors and uh, build up. We have a responsibility, I think, to help revive downtown. A couple of parishioners noticed his efforts and nominated Father Eric for the Business Courier's 40 Under 40 Award, an award he won. And he's getting more press, this month appearing on the cover of Cincy Magazine as one of the city's most interesting people. You're just as likely to see Father Eric in running gear as in a Roman collar. He runs 6 to 12 miles a day, 5 or 6 days a week. And he tries to get in two marathons a year. He's even appeared in an Adidas ad. It's really a par uh, parallel to the story of Emmaus. Things happen on the road. I clear my head. I come into contact with God. I run with others and we talk and we share our stories and share our heartbreaks and joys. So while civic leaders pursue residential, retail and restaurant interests in downtown, this parish priest has got religion covered. I always say I'm the, the little guy who opens the windows and hopes that the Holy Spirit comes in and that people can really see how exciting this place can be. Father Knapp has breathed new life into this parish, which in turn has helped breathe new life into downtown. The parishioners here now are much younger, and when they come here to attend Mass, they stay in town, spending time and money. Brian? Thanks, Patricia. This will be the third year for the block party. It's modeled after one like it in Chicago. Watch Fifth Third Business Beat Fridays at 7.30 p.m. on CET or online anytime at CETConnect.org.